engineering is for boys. Girls are supposed to get married and take care of children. Having born in a small city in India, hearing these things was not the most uncommon thing. Everyone used to say these things to me, but it just never mattered because I always had my dad by my side to tell me that, hey Jeffy, if you want something, you can get it. Just keep working hard. Okay, yeah, maybe it was not as easy as it sounded, but it definitely felt possible because every time I looked up, I had my biggest support system by my side, my dad. I was ready to take on the world until one day. I lost my dad due to an accident when I was 11. In a matter of one night, it hit me. Then I'm alone and I have no one to motivate me and my fate would be just that, getting married and taking care of children. I did what seemed like the next right thing to do, look up at my mother. But honestly, she had just invested so much emotions on my dad that without him being there, she was mentally and physically not prepared to see what was going on. I seeked out my older brother. And he was my older brother, but you know, without my dad, he did not have any sort of guidance either. I was pretty sure that I would not be able to complete my high school because we didn't have that much money and college was just out of question. I mean, how can I? I'm alone and I'm 12. I cannot possibly do all these things by myself. That seemed like the end of my story. There goes the girl who was ready to take on the world. Little did I know that things were about to get messier. Soon, a family member who I was living with stopped me from going out anymore. I used to tutor kids, and I was not allowed to do that either. Without my dad around, it was really easy for everyone to push me around. This was the moment I realized that someone has to be the adult here. If my mom and my brother are not prepared for it yet, it has to be me. At the age of 12, I was faced with two decisions. I can either listen to what everyone says and do what the society had designed for me, which is getting married and taking care of children, or I could be the person who my dad was willing to support while going against the society. Well, I chose the second. Very soon, due to many different circumstances, my family and I had an opportunity to move to the States. Now, here I am, having graduated high school with high honors attending the University of Minnesota. I guess my dad was right. If I work hard enough, I can get what I want. And girls can do engineering. Many crew.